Hi folks, Sean with the Wingman Woman 5 channel. Thanks for checking in. Today we're going to be talking about sunglasses. So stick around. For a lot of folks that follow me on social media, on my other platforms, Instagram and Facebook, they know that I do power wood carving and pyography. And the reason that I bring this up is that a while back I suffered a eye injury where I had a splinter removed from my right eye. I was doing some power carving. I'll put in a little photo here of a uh, Odin uh, that I made. But long story short, I had a splinter removed from my eye and it got me thinking more about eye protection, especially in uh, the shooting sports aspect of it. Now, you guys know this channel, we're not big powder burner uh, channel. We like to do air guns, but with that, you can incur eye injuries with air guns as well. A lot of stuff that we're using is high pressure air and crazy stuff can happen. Uh, we'll just leave it at that. So as I'm getting older, I'm starting to think about that safety should be paramount no matter what. So a while back, I had done a review of a belt for Core Essentials. They're located in La Mesa, California, which is really close to me within minutes of driving. And I got to uh, look at their website and I noticed that they had sunglasses also that they made and they also made ballistic sunglasses. So I reached out to them. They sent me a pair. I've been testing them out for about a month. If you've been following along on any of my hunting trips, uh, you're going to notice them. They've been getting a lot of cameo appearances on the channel. And it is the uh, Recon Ballistic Sunglasses. So what I'm gonna do is cut away. We'll do a quick specs rundown of these glasses. We'll show you up close and personal, and then we'll come back and we'll talk about them. So let's talk about these glasses. First off, the frames are very robust and there's a reason for that. If they're ballistic sunglasses, you do not want flimsy frames at all. They do look really stylish. And what I like about them is that there's not a lot of gaps. It's a really close fit all around. So if you're into shooting sports, there's not a lot of hot brass. Sometimes I've shot guns that spit lead for whatever reason. The cylinder doesn't line up with the barrel and you wind up getting lead fragments on you. It happens uh, if you're into shooting sports. Air guns, high pressure air, I'm always worried about having some sort of catastrophic failure. And uh, now that I'm getting older, I'm really, really cognizant of the fact that I need to take care of my eyes. Uh, you only have two, and I want them to last for a very long time. Now, let's talk about the lenses, polarized lenses. I've been running Oakley M frames for years. Oakley optics are some of the best in the business. And I'm gonna put my reputation on the line on this. These lenses are very outstanding, great optics, and I'm gonna put them up there of equal to or greater than Oakley Optics. There, mic drop, I said it review over. No, really, I'm putting my reputation on the line. These optics are on point and they're crystal clear. The um, polarization of the lenses are outstanding. Now they have earth magnets that are in there. Maybe you can see it there. And you can close these sunglasses down they lock in. Reason being is a lot of times 
you go into a building and you put your sunglasses in your collar of your shirt like I do. Well, you bend over, you're moving around, something happens, all of a sudden you've dropped your glasses. For me, they always wind up hitting the asphalt, they wind up hitting rocks, and I've messed up more lenses that way than I can count. This way, look how tight that's fitted on there. Also, there is a magnetic strap that will hook to your visor, and I'll insert some photos here, where you can basically clip those sunglasses to your visor to keep them out of the way. They're not sitting on a dash, they're not falling in your truck, floating around, getting all scratched, getting all tore up. Also, comes with a really cool looking hard case. And these will fit in a cup holder of your truck or your car, fits in a water bottle holder on your backpack, very secure, keeping your glasses when you're traveling from getting all messed up, especially if you uh, are like me and you toss it into a shooting bag and then all of a sudden the lens pops out and you're looking around and you're getting all upset and you're having a bad day. It just happens. It happens, folks. I'm just putting it out there. So with that, the hard case, the strap is definitely a check in the plus column. I'm going to list the uh, mil spec on these glasses as far as being safety glasses and ballistic glasses. I must say, as I've been wearing them for about a month, I've worn them on a couple hunting trips, worn them around town. They're stylish. The fit, the finish, the feel is on point. And like I said, uh, the optics and the clarity of these lenses is equal to or above Oakley. So with that said, folks, um, I give stuff a rating of one to five stars. With this, the fit, the finish, the feel, stylish, uh, functionality, philosophy of use, clarity of the lenses, I'm gonna give it five stars for the whole system. Uh, I'm gonna leave links in the video description below to uh, Core Essentials. If you wanna learn more about this product, they're a uh, local San Diego company. I love supporting local folks. And uh, if you're into concealed carry, if you're into shooting sports, they just have a lot of fashion stuff too. They don't just sell glasses and all that stuff. So. Check them out. Check out their belts. I'll leave links in the video description below of the belt review I did. And with that, folks, I thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care, folks.